Hi YouTube, it's me Ramley Cousin and today we are touring the Island of Daffodil and as you already noticed I did put like an iron tour trailer out for you guys so yeah so we're actually going to tour um, Daffodil today and I think the name is, if I can't pronounce this right guys don't blame me for this I think, I think the YouTuber who made this island was called Ferrell's Crossing well if, if I can't pronounce it right don't blame me but if you know how to pronounce the name it's fine so first off you know what I'm going to do before we start let's have a look at the map okay so there's our resident who is Forest Crossing of course who the one who created this beautiful island so let's see who our residents are so our residents are Fang, Solana, Carmen, Henry, Dotty, Azalea, Kelly, Goldie, Freckles, and and Pate. Well, that's cool. She's got a good selection. Oh yeah, I might as well show you the what do you name it the the dream address while well, I'm at. Sorry guys, I was just thinking. Oh, I forgot to show you the dream address. Never mind. But at least you can see it on the screen now. So dream address is D I, and as you can see where it is, it's on the bottom. So you guys probably want to pause the video first off, and then you can like catch the dream address. If not, I'll put in the links in the description for you just in case. Okay. So first off, let's have a look on our iron, shall we? Start our tour. Wow, there's a lot of arms on the floor. So this is where I'm thinking, yeah, what should I do when it comes to these items? So, well, some of these are like a lot of presents, but. I'm not really sure what I should do with these mm. items. Should I dress up mm. in them? But I'm gonna have a little check, but I've not done it before. But I'm gonna take all these um, presents ones first because I'm not sure what the hangout items are about, but we'll see. Right, there's all the items, right. Let's see, let's unbox them and see what there are, shall we? Let's see what we've got. A wig with a ribbon. Okay, so I guess that's sort of like a like a little outfit to go with the gardening sort of spring core theme, you know what I mean? I think it's like a spring core iron because it's definitely why I like the idea of daffodil as a good name. Now we've got a, was it a wide bream straw hat? Well, that could be a farmer's hat, but it sort of depends. I like how she's got a lot of hats. We've got the glass purse. Well, that's sort of like a, is it a bag or is it just a bag? I think it might be a bag. Well, I thought it was a purse for once. If you haven't got any purse in the game. The wingtip shoes, so whatever they are. Let's go on to the next one and see what we get. Well, this we've got a dress called, I think it's called stripped hold, hold to us dress. That's cool. Right, let's see what the next one is as well while we're at it. The feral dress. Well, I'm definitely wearing that one, but let's see what the last one is. Wow, so these are all dresses. We've got the classical kink dress. Let's see what this one looks like first before we start. Wow, I love this. This is cool. Right, now let's put this one and see how this goes. Yeah, it's like a little purse, but what the hat? Yeah, that looks cool. Let's try the shoes on the shower. we? Yeah, they look good. Right, I like the idea of it, but the thing mm -hmm. I know that um, Kate on Gallo goes when she does this, she mm -hmm. takes all the items. But I thought, well, mm -hmm. if I want to dress up it, like you know, exclusively for this island, I might as well. Mm -hmm. So where should I start? Well, mm -hmm. maybe we should start near the neighbourhood little area and have a little look around and have a little look see. Well, it's kind of like a, mm -hmm. it's kind of quite good where this little mm -hmm. neighbourhood is because you've got like a little mm -hmm. brick path in and that stuff. Mm -hmm. And I'm trying to think who's our first resident. I might have to check the map while I'm at this, so let's see who it might be. Right, who am I close to? Oh, it's the Vara's house. But well, I like how they've changed the house experience, because lucky from like, you know, 2.0, like, you know, the 2.0 update, it's really helped out a lot. Because if we didn't have the, like, you know, the, the 2.0 update, we couldn't have to remod their houses. Ah. Oh. She hasn't got her, so I think she's like a starter beard, isn't she, Zavala? Because she hasn't got like a, you know, sort of, like original home, I would say. Because this is what you always, this one, this one would you actually start with. If it's one of your starter beards, they'll look like this. Hmm, ah. Oh, I'm sorry. Here you are, trying to talk to me, and I've got, I've got my head in the clouds. Have bar. I don't know how to pronounce that by the way, it's kind of hard to when you get one of these coach phrases you can't pronounce them, it's kind of hard for me sometimes. 
I wonder if this is where what folks mean when they say they feel like and they live in a dream. Yeah, you might be right, Zavala. Well, this is what this is what the normal's house would sort of look like. But if if you didn't get her as your starter, she'll look much different. So I'll probably you probably want to check on Wikipedia on that sort of stuff because when you get them as a starter. Their star home might not be the best, but once they get their, like, their actual homes, they're normally alright sometimes. But let's have a look around, shall we? Well, we've got the wheat field iron, which I feel like is a very good arm to use. Although I've not used it on my irons yet, and, and unfortunately, I really want that item because it looks so good. Because farm core irons and probably a few different cores could have this wheat field iron, but I've not had it before. But it, I like how it's like bust into this sort of design but look at the beach I think it's like a little dining table area but it looks like it's like a little wedding venue sort of thing but it doesn't look like a wedding venue but it does look like one but you've got pancakes you've got like golden syrup you know I might as well use the 2.0 item thing so we can have a little check on it okay so here we are we've we've really like a little wedding sort of cake and you've got pancakes and you've got like like probably like like a milkshake sort of thing or just something like that then you've got it's like little pie then you've got like another piece of can cakes and you've got like a little seating area it's quite a nice though and it? it's like a little wedding or like a little camping area I quite like it to be honest it's also quite you know spring themed so i like how it's set in spring but i'm not sure what time of day it's set up let me check oh six a.m in the morning that's a good time to start isn't it and plus you've got this like little beach area where you can just sit sit down and relax and that stuff. It's kinda good, isn't it? I think I'll probably want to do more of these and see what we can find. Oh look, we've got a fish there. Let's see what's over this little area. I'm quite intrigued. Wow, look at this! This is looks kinda mysterious. I've not I wonder if it's like a cabin or is it just a, a house or something like that. It looks kind of like a little dressing area. I'm not really sure what this area is sort of called, but it looks kind of good though, doesn't it? Let me just see if I oh, I'll press the wrong button. Hold on. Get back on the camera wrap while I'm at it. <laughs> I can't believe that. But, uh, let's use my special item. Yeah, it's like... Uh, I'm trying to think, but it looks like a little... Like a little, like... I'm not sure. Is it like a little hotel or is it like a... Um, like a little holiday home near here. I'm not really sure, but if it was like something to do with, like you know, sort of basic. But I'm not really sure what this build's all about yet. But again, I have not watched like you know the whole like you know little series of how she made this island either. So this is all quite new to me. So I'll I'll find out soon enough on that front. But I think as you go over to where the little beard the little area there, I think it's like a little town district. I'll go and have a look around here. Wow. I like how these I like how the custom designs are fit into this sort of vibe. So I think over here is like a little shopping district. I think I'll say it because it looks like a marketplace or whatever. But just look at it. You got flowers. That's definitely cool. You got your own little hat. I don't know why, but I can see a Zadia over there, can you? She thinks she's just over there for no reason, but I'll probably go and check, go and see her in a minute. But let's have a look at the the little thing and see what we can find. So, we've got like... So we've got some clothes here, so we've got some clothing items, a little feather duster. You've got to have feather duster on sale, but it's like they're near where the Nook's Cranny is, so it looks kind of good in a way. And plus... That's a good item to have. I've never seen that item. You know we've got like vehicles now in Animal Crossing New Horizons as well. We've we also got the van item. It's kind of good because it means it might be like a marketplace. But again, if you're thinking about it, if two Tommy really into delivering stuff or do like, you know, is it click and collect these days? Yeah, click and collect. They can come and get their stuff from there. Or they can go and ship it online or something, which is quite good, isn't it? How you got that? But I wonder if I can get over there. No, it's kind of blocked. Hmm. Well, let's see where we can where we can go next. There might be a lot of like lot of other places that we've not seen before. But let's just have a look around, shall we? On this other side. Yeah, now a bit of like a little neighbourhood sort of area. So we've got another house here, but I'm not sure who this village's house is. So let's see.
Oh, it's Azalea's house. Yeah, I don't know why I couldn't recognise it. Hmm. But she's not in her house because, as you can see, she's already been busy, isn't she? Let's have a look on the beach again. I feel like I'm a bit intrigued to see what's on the beach. But look, we've got like a little seating area. Maybe when it comes to the summertime, you can just hang out with your friends. And look, even got a little scramble book. You know what I mean? This is all good, though, isn't it? Having like a little beach area, you can just decorate it. Because sometimes you can always forget to yourselves. Well, beaches need some decorating, so if you get to like, decorate your beaches, then it's going to become neglected, you know, so I'm glad that she actually, um, you know, made sure that the beaches were decorated too, so let's see what's over, over this bridge. I think this is like a little clothing store, because you've got like these little clothing items, and it's like all that's been advertised, and I bet that's where Zabel sits sometimes, outside, so I bet she, in her free time, when she's not, like, you know, Bet when she's got a, like you know free time, I bet she hangs outside half the time because half the time we don't see her do. She never comes out of Able Sisters, so it kind of makes sense that when we're not all around, she randomly does something in her free time. But she never has time to do all that stuff, does she? That Sable, but you know Mabel's got a lot of stuff on her mind sometimes. But look, it's like they're selling some clothing mm. items, and plus it's kind of good that we got the bag item because. They are literally the best arm you could ever get in the game. Plus, you could also really customise them. I wonder if you can or not. I'll probably find out soon enough, but it's kind of good, isn't it? I think Spring Core is definitely a good, um, like, like aesthetic to go with because you, there's a few other ones that you could think about when it comes to, like, you know, seasonal aesthetics that you can go with. But Spring is definitely a good one. But I wonder what's over here. Oh, you know what? This looks like a, like, well. It looks like kind of a restaurant, no, it's like a bakery and it's got like a flower shop next to it. It's like a little shopping district in a way. Because look at how the, look how it looks. We've got a bakery, you've got your own little sitting area, so we've got like a bakery over here. And everyone's sitting down, oh look, and you've got pancakes. Well, I think that's twice I've seen that I am. Whoa, didn't know I was sat there, but let's have a look at, it. imagine if I was sitting here just, you know, devouring this sandwich yeah that'd be nice well i like how this came out as well that's definitely one of the biggest builds that i've never seen before making like a, a flower shop and a bakery next door to each other that's pretty fascinating i like it and it looks like we've got an ice cream shop but again i'm not sure who owns the ice cream shop in particular so again i'd have no idea but it's good they've got a little ice cream shop I wonder what's ah a little library area as well so it's kind of good because you've got one is a big like you know big area over there like a little bakery little area then we've got like a little um like you've got a little flower like little shop next to the bakery then we've got a little library area like you can buy your books for free or you could just buy them for extra bells whatever then you've got an ice cream together so all of this is really combined i think this should be like a popular one to everyone to visit and what I did not see this. You've got your own little cinema out here. That is absolutely cool. Because look, you've got your own little muffins. You all sit down together and watch a film outside. Well, watching a film outside is definitely out of the normal, but it's better than nothing. But let's go and talk to Fang, because I've not actually talked to them yet. Let's see what he's got to say. Hello there, I don't think we've met. You're new around here, or maybe it's possibly I am, who knows. Honestly, it doesn't matter that I am pleased to meet you all the same, Kachomp. Gah. <laughs> I think this is like a little chill zone area, like a little like a little chill zone camping area when you all scare around the fire and oh wow, look we've got some Chris on the floor. That is absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I don't know why, but I think this will be one of my favourite ones to visit again. I quite like this island for some reason. It's kind of a good one. So I was thinking, if there's more like different cores, like iron cores, then there's going to be a contest because they've got to do a contest on which iron cores the best, you know? Because I would love to have that as a future video. But I like how this spring core iron came out so good, you know? Oh, hi, Pate. I didn't see you there. Hey, new face. Yay! Are you like one of my fans? I mean, of course you are. I don't think she's got an idea that I'm not one of her fans, but to be honest now, 
It's meeting me a dream come true, Crackle. It has to be because you know this is a dream that you're meeting me. So there you have it. Well, that's amazing, but this will be where Kevin will show up, but he never shows up on dream dresses, so please take note of that because he never shows up. But who knows, we might see Brewster, but I'm probably leaving that to a later date. But I'm not sure, but I like this little archway, or is it like a... Probably a coin archway, because I can't think of the name for this item, but it's kind of good though, isn't it? They made these very good items. It's just, it's, 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 it's just, just fascinating. So look, I bet this is like a little washing area, sewing area, and like you have to wash stuff on the beach. You know what? That's a really good idea, putting it right there. Let's see what we can find down this way. Wow, a hammock. So I bet if you're thinking to yourself, well, I need to get away from the the, the town, and I want somewhere to quiet just to do my me and my time. Then you can just chill out on the beach, couldn't you? Listen to some music and all that stuff. That would be awesome. And wow, if you want to, like, you know, team up with your friends, you can just chill out here and do some sewing. You could, like, do some more, like, stuff, do your homework or whatever. But I like how how, the, how this all come out. This is really the best iron I've ever gone to. And look, that's cool. You've got an, uh, you've got an outdoor settee. Everything's outdoor, and plus we've got a little bike there. We've got like a little post on the side. Now I think I wonder who where who this one belongs to because this build must be linked to one of the vehicles on the iron. But I wonder who this one might be. Is it Henry? Let me guess. Is it Henry? It's not. It's not Fang. It's not her. Oh, it's Caddy's. You know, what, let's go and see Caddy because I know that when I was doing my last. Um, Iron Sword video. I didn't go inside all the everyone, all the villagers' houses, did I? I was like kind of busy and thinking about other stuff, you know. But this time, we're gonna go and see all the villagers' houses and go and say hello to all the villagers. So let's have a little chat with Caddy. It's not a five-star resort, but feel free to relax here as long as you like. I'll try to be smooth in presence. Of course, not so smooth and then you fall asleep yeah that's true the thing is i feel like there's a few villagers that have not like you know been on everybody's arm but i like how they've saw including the others that never been on like you know that they aren't they aren't popular but they're kind of least popular but i wish they were all like you know had their sort of popularity because Callie and all the other squirrels and some other squirrels or something like that they don't have the best popularity in the animal crossing portal.com and the whole thing and i like how like you know some of them are now actually in everybody's um dream addresses these days so i'm happy that Callie's one of them but hopefully say in one of them soon but that's good isn't it because in a day you've got to have a mixture of different villagers. You can't just go with the same ones half the time, can you? So it's good to have some leaf popular ones that might finally get into a drill drill. But let's see what's over this little area. It's kind of like a little chill zone over here for some reason. Wow. I like how they use this wedding like little chair. Because I know for sure that when it gets to June, which is like one month's time now, we might get to do Reese and Cyrus thing and do some more decorating stuff. So, at least we've got something special for June. But again, I think we're all expecting for like a bit of a big update, which we're not sure of at the moment. But, yeah, I can't get over there because I haven't got my ladder. <laughs> well, that's what I mean. I can't wait for that to, like, you know, start happening. But let's see what I can do because at the moment there's so much items around here. I'm not sure how I host it up to the top, so we might have oh big enough which we actually can use these little stairs, little ladders, right. Actually I've not actually toured this bit. No, I don't know, I think I have. No. Well this is quite cool, isn't it, in a way, because look at this. Like literally. You've got your own like hang on, let me just oh no, that's not gonna work because it's gonna go the other way. Whoopsie can't do that because it's not going to work man but look at this like literally look at this it looks good doesn't it you, you've got your own little sitting here like a private little sitting there that you can talk with your friends you know what i mean it's awesome isn't it but right let's see where we can oh don't tell me to get stuck uh, uh, oh. <laughs> i think i'm trapped i can't go up there for some reason 
Yeah, that's, that's the unfortunate thing. You have to keep moving around in case one of the items get you in, in dose, but... We'll see where we... Where, I'm not sure where area, what area we haven't visited yet, like, you know, next, but let's go and see who we can find. Oh, hi, Freckles. What are you doing? Hi there, stranger. You're new around here, right? Mm. Or, or, like, maybe I'm new around here. And who knows, right? Anyway, I think you're gonna like Daffodil. It tossed dreamy, ducky. Ah, oh, it's good to have freckles in there too because, again, no one goes for the ones who might need more like love in the community, don't they? In their requesting community, but it'd be nice if they could have more like, like underrated villages that are actually on different lines for once. Because sometimes you can like think to yourself. What iron core am I going to focus on? Which vid is going to fit that? You know what I mean? But again, you could always have um, Azalea for like, you know, spring core, for example. Let's see what we can do. Let's go up here. I think there must be something special up here. Wow. I don't know what, but I like the purple item for some reason. It's definitely a good item to have because look, if it, there's the good thing about this item. So, one thing is if you're being chased by warps, this thing will literally keep you under protection for the wasps and they'll just go away. See, this is why I love this item, but I think there's a few like villager houses up here, but, and you've got this like little, like sitting area, like a little tourist attraction sort of area, but it's like a little chill area. And plus, I like this, it's got like, this little tree item. I think it's like a little plantation item, but it's kind of cool. I like the idea of making it into like a little park, little area, and making it all like, you know, spring and all that stuff. Try to think, who do you think who could be living in this house? This time, I'm gonna guess. I'm not looking at the map this time. But I think I might never make this my last house. Oh my word! This house has been remodeled. This is crazy. And guess what? It's Dotty. Hi, Dotty. Oh, hey, I was hoping someone would visit me. Would visit. We won. I got so bored lately, I almost drifted off to sleep, but like falling asleep in a dream, just. just too weird. Wow, this looks so good. I like how her house has now turned into, like, you know, like, like a dream. Like her house needed a big remodel, and look at this. It looks beautiful. And she's got her own little sofa. You know what? I think if we do more house remodels, I think it's going to be the best for the, our villagers. But this looks just lovely. And it fits Daffodil's vibe. So yeah, I kind of like that house. That's what I mean. If they do more house remodels with their houses, they might have more chances, to be honest. So yeah. Well, I may, I'll probably make this my last house to visit. So we'd have to go and see all the villagers, you know. So... There's Resident Search where you actually start from, if you're dreaming it, if you're doing it that way. But let's see what's up here. Wow. I'm not sure what this is, but it looks like a, a, a mini cafe express because you've got the van there. What would you think? It's like a little mini cafe area. It looks like someone's dropped their notebook again. I wonder who dropped that on the floor. <laughs> I bet it was one of her villages, but it's kind of like a good little area. I think, you know, I'm going to actually sit on there because I kind of like it sitting here. But just look at it for a second. You've got your own little cup of tea. You get to chill. You've got your own like, little, coffee, like, little coffee shop right near like the right where the rest of the services is, which is kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah. I think I'm definitely visiting this island again for once. It's definitely the best. Wow, that's good. You've got your own little, like, it's like a little, like a little oasis a little bit. You've got these little water fountains right near where the little benches are. And I like how the, how it all combined is. So, you know what I mean? You could always do amazing builds and it looked just perfect and that stuff. And plus, you can do some photography over here and you can just chill out on a sunny day or something. Right, let's see what we can find over here because I'm not... Oh look, another item. We've got like another little area, but I like these little little partitions. They're kind of good as well. <gasps> and there's a gyroid. I did not see that gyroid. But guess what? It blends in with the whole like garden scheme and spring course scheme. So it all works. So yeah, I think I'm definitely visiting this island again 
because it's absolutely, you know, gorgeous this island. And I feel like if there was more of these islands, I would not, won't stop visiting non-stop. I'll just tell you because I just like this island for some reason. It's kind of a good island. Right, what's over here? Like it's like we've got this like little um little area. So we've got like a little bike shop over there so you can park your bikes. A little like little area so you can just chill out with your friends if you're gonna think that they come and visit this island. But the thing is, if I was like getting myself planned up for my island, I probably would do more like this and then it probably would get a five star and then before you know it, you can come visit my island at one point, but who knows? Oh hi Goldie. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. I don't want to I would want to talk to Goldie, but I feel like I want to continue the tour in a way because I'm wasting a lot of time on doing this, so yeah. Right, I think this is like another flower shop. I love how there's more and more flower shop. Wow, look at all these plants. Like, look at all these flowers. Like, all white. Like, wow. It's such a good combo. This is so good. Oh, I think it's like a flower garden, so as you go up here, you, you must like, you know, sit there and chill. And up here, you've got your own little... Wow, I love this. This is really the best little build that she's also made. So she made two massive builds in this iron. This iron, I'm never leaving. I love this iron for some reason. So, I wonder who lives here, but I'm still guessing that at your fan's house. But look at... But I like how this has all come out because I like how all the trees combined and we've also got a lot of white flowers so it's all giving me spring core fires straight away. Oh wow, I didn't know that. We've got a beehive area and there's wolves. No, I think I'll run away from those wolves. So yeah, this is all like spring core fires. I love it. And plus, I think, is that supposed to be, um, olives? Let me just get my camera around. And then, hang on, I might have to get my character in, in the area. And then press this button. Are they olives? Or they're grapes? Hmm, that could be something I want to know about. But look at this island, it's pretty good, isn't it? Right, let me just check on the map so I don't want to miss out anything else because you know what I mean, it's just, it's just that's what just happens. We haven't got to a, a house yet but I think it's in the middle so we might want to check out the museum area and that's the next bit to see. So, hmm, how do I get back actually? That's, that's going for starters. Uh, oh, yeah, I might have to go all the way back again. Hang on a sec, I might have to run this bit so you guys can see what's going on. Because, again, this is going to be a long video, isn't it? Looking at this. <laughs> uh, right, back to resident services. Let's see where we can go here. So, well, it's like nowhere. Well, right, let's go, let's go on like, top of the bridge and see what we can find. Right, let's go over here. Oh look, we've got a little wishing well. Didn't notice there's a wishing well. That's cool. And plus, we're using, she's using a bit of the mushroom items. That's good because when it wasn't 2.0, we had more like, you know, some mushroom items that kept the iron cores going for a while until 2.0 lost, you know? So it's kind of good. Oh, that's cool. You've got your own little reading little area. No, it's like a typewriter area. Oh, so if you're like a typewriter, then you can type some some stuff out, you know? So yeah, let's have a look around, shall we? Okay, so that's where the museum is, and you might have seen this in my iron tour, well, trailer, to say the least, because it was, I thought you might like the look at this, because it looks like a very good idea, putting all the flowers, and even the green mums. I think they actually like green, actually, according to me. Yeah, they might be like green, but they look cool, don't they? Oh yeah, it looks good, doesn't it? It looks pretty, you know, kind of cool. But I would want to go into the museum, but I think we're leaving that to another day. But I do love this island, it's pretty good. Right. And I like how they, they put like little bunnies out and little ducks, you know? It's kind of cool. Let me just check if I've not missed anything out. Hmm. I don't think I have, have I? Hmm. I'm not really sure. Yeah, I'm not what, what, you know, that sure, but I think we've got like another villager's home, but it looks like they're at, they've got like the little fishing rod, they're about to go and do some fishing, so I bet this one's a fisherman, so let's just check who this villager house is first beforehand. Um, who is at the top? 
Um, oh, it's Henry. So Henry's got his own little fish in there because of the frogs. So that's a good idea going for spring. Going for a frog village is a saint like that. It's kind of cool. Let's have a look around here. Oh, look. That's a good place to think about it because you know we've got like. You know that gold is a dog, isn't she? Well, it's kind of funny that that they've actually put like little dog houses right next to her little place. It's kind of cool, isn't it? And plus that item as well, which is, which is kind of the weirdest item that I could always say, but I can't think of what to say about it. <laughs> and then you've got this like little, I'm not sure, it's like a little playground area, but in spring. So... I'm trying to think, how am I going to find, you know, Flora Crossing's, like, house? Let me check. Have I gone the wrong way? I have. What? Well, that's a bit of a bummer, because I was going to go and see what a house looked like. But at least you can see what's going on while I'm doing this. So, yeah. Well, that's cool. I, I'll try to think who, who this might be living at this house quickly before you know it. Um, Pate. So Pate owns her own little area. It's kind of like, well, one thing she's into art. Next thing she's doing laundry or something like that. And, yeah. And she's got a little kids area. So I wonder if she likes to camp outside for a living and watch the stars. That'd be something. So I like how they've just how she designed their villages and like homes in particular. But I need to figure out where her actual house is. So it's gonna take me a while. But I just can't just caught my eye. I think it is like a well a private area. I've got quite a private area, and plus she's got her own little like it's, I think it, is it supposed to be like a vending machine or a bank? Oh, what if this is actually a bank? It is a bank, oh, what was I thinking? <laughs> oh, they've got, she's got her own little bank area as well. She could have even included any bank villages to go with this, couldn't she? Mm. But let's hope I can find her house so we can finish this off, you know, because I have no idea where she's put her house. Right, let's have a look around. So that's where the museum is. But according to my map, am I on close? No, I'm literally, I need to keep going. So, it's not this way. Right. Maybe it's, maybe it's this way? Let me check, let me check. Is that right? Yeah. I went the wrong way by accident, but at least I got to see more stuff, you know, alright. Oh, look. I guess we could also do. Climb the ladder. Oh, look, there's Flora Crossing. What's she going to say? Flowers. You know what? Daffodils definitely the best island. I think they should actually put this down as a fav like definitely like a like a popular island to go and visit, and probably the best one, like one of the top five sort of dream just because this island's just you know extraordinary. I like it. I just don't want to leave it because it looks so. It's got a lot of items in it, and plus it looks so good. Wow. I'm actually overwhelmed right now. This just looks lovely, because it seems like you've got your own little dining room and it's, it's you've got little sofas and you're sitting down to chill out. It looks kind of lovely, doesn't it? And you've got your little campfire, so you know what I mean? I like when they have spring core like beams inside the house into it, but let's see what's on this little roof here so we can have a little look and see what's going on on this little thing. Wow. A lot of things with, with spring core today, wow. I, I'm guessing, is this where they like, you know, they've got their own little garden little area, so I think this is like a, an indoor flower little exhibit, I will say, because there's so many flowers, so I bet, I bet she like, you know, waters her plants, you know, I feel like, I feel like this iron's definitely come up so well, I think this should be in the top five for Drew Dresses for sure, because this iron is like, you know, so natural. It's not cottage core by any means. I don't think it is cottage core. If it was cottage core, I would see it. But it looks more spring core to me. So, whatever you guys think about this island, you might think of wow. And this sort of looks like a wow. 
don't know what to say. This is mad. You only got your like, little little like bathroom, and you got your own little big jacuzzi. Wow. I don't know what this iron's got to offer. It looks absolutely gorgeous. You know what? I want to feed this iron again. I absolutely love this iron for some reason. I feel like if there was more sprinkle irons, I'll literally go after it. I'll say that. So yeah. Right, let's see what's upstairs, because I bet there's something I've got to see up here. Let's see what I can find. Wow. Wow. I think I like the Spring Core Vibes here. It, it absolutely stuns me right now, because... you thinking about it. Having, like, you know, Spring Core Island and making these house interiors inside your actual house, it looks kind of good, doesn't it? Plus you've got your own little double, like, got your own little double bed so you can just sleep on it if you wanna. Then you've got your own little craft in there, you've got your own little place so you can actually do some sewing, you can, you know what I mean? I, I feel like this iron should be in the top five, because, don't know why I keep saying it, but it's definitely a good iron to visit. I think I will definitely link the drone dress down for you guys, so you guys can go and visit it, because it's definitely a natural. But if there's more, like, you know, drill dresses that you're interested in, then I probably would do some more. Like, you know, every Friday, for example, because this video will be posted on Friday anyway for you guys, so you probably would know that anyway. But let's have a look down here. Wow. I think this is a kitchen area. But just look at it. The partitions. You know what I mean? There's more partitions than I expected in this house, but it looks... It all looks so good together, but I'm gonna have to. There's so much, like you know, stuff in here. I can't even, can't even bear it for a minute. So I'm gonna try and do is use my little special iron so I can have a little check on this little area. Wow, this is so good. So you got your own little kitchen there, and you got that chicken curry, or I think it's like, or button up squash cup or whatever then you've got your own little pie you've got your own little coffee you've got your coffee espresso my i think you'll definitely want to live in this house wouldn't you if you're visiting this one again i think spring cores definitely plays a very good part i think we need to do more spring corns because this is absolutely good but i'm not sure it looks kind of cottagey as well so maybe it's a mix of two cores so one thing it's spring the next thing it's you know cottage cores so yeah, maybe I might be right on that. Well, this is seen our house today, so I was, I was starting to wonder, where's our house? You know, I was starting to wonder, so... Yeah. Well, at least you get to see the iron today, because... I've been... Obviously, over the years, it's not been its best. I had to fix a few things this week to get it working, but it's managed to work this time, so yeah. So, I was sort of thinking, because she's also a content creator on YouTube, so... If you do want to like see more iron tools from her, you can always go and check her out if you want to. But I have, I'm not sure how to get her like link in the description. But if not, you could go and like you know go and see her and maybe like you know stub to her or something like that. But again, you know what? I feel like this iron deserves being the top five because it looks good. And I wish that there'd be more spring court irons that I can go and see. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go back into resident services. I'm gonna check the notice board just for just the last minute. Oh, wow. I did not know. She actually made a flower on there. Isn't that look so good, you know? You know what? I feel like this island definitely has been the top five. So if I was rating this island, 10 out of 10 for me. Make sure to leave a like on this video, and if you're new to my channel and want to see more of my content, please subscribe because there's a variety of content you might enjoy which might involve Animal Crossing content or the Utopia content. It sort of depends really, but if you guys want to see more Lion Tour videos on every Friday, then please let me know because Iron Tours are definitely a good idea. I do like doing these Iron Tours, but I wish I could do more of them in the future if you guys are more interested in that, etc. And also turn notifications for other Animal Crossing and Me content from me. That's why I'm staying with Animal Crossing and I'll see you in the next one. So bye!